All right, guys, so we made our way down the valley here, um, and the facility that the Torians had told us that had lots of stuff in it doesn't really have a lot of stuff in it. It's like a manufacturing facility here, but what they really wanted is um, there's like a data house um, housed below this thing. So what they want is the data information from there. But uh, before we got here, they had already snuck in. I guess they used us as a diversion earlier on to sneak in and disable all the defenses. So now they're bringing in their crews here um, to reactivate the turrets and defend this place while they try to loot the uh, um, data housing here. So that's how we're going to get paid. We have to defend this facility. Um, hopefully they get uh, enough information out of here and we can grab some mech parts before we get out of here. But we've got about 10 turns to wait. So, um, yeah, we're kind of stuck up here. Looks like the uh, Federated Sons knows we're here too. Or at least these they follow the Torians here. So now we got to take these guys on. So I'm hoping to gauge these guys early. Ooh. Probably a bushwhacker. 20 ton Mac. Okay, not bad. Is that a vehicle? Looks like it. All right. All right, Rocky, let's get, um, we want to get right on these guys as fast as possible. Um, let's move up over here. Can't see anybody yet, but we'll get to a position where we can move in on them. What do we got here? We got four mechs. Okay. 20 and known. Okay. Just hoping to have eyes on. 40 tonner. All right. Not too bad so far. All right, let's move a sprint. Can we get eyes on? Nope, still nothing. Oh wait, what did that do? Is there something over here? Wait, I saw something. Thought there was a line here that was, I'm just going crazy, that's what it is. All right, we're gonna move around to here. Gonna close with these guys as fast as we can. Probably going to have one or two turns. If they're going to have reinforcements, they're going to be in faster. So let's move up here and help these guys out. All right, end it there. Why are you going that way? Dude, you're going to get your ass killed. Let's get off the road then. Let's move this way. We're going to try and engage the 20 and the 40 tonner, get them killed quickly. Okay, one more turn and we'll have these turrets up. Alright, Rocky. Let's push these turkeys. We want to see who they all are. Let's see who they all are where we attack these guys. Got lots of evasion, so what do we got here? A Javelin 10, Bushwhacker, LBX 20. 800 and some odd armor. Two SM6s with almost no armor. Cicada. That's the weaker version of the Cicada. And a Locust. So, we're going to target this Locust because, damn. Let's fire everything. Ah, not too bad, I guess. Four hits. Here comes the Whacker. As long as he's not shooting. That javelin's going to take some heavy damage in a minute. I want to try and pull down as many mechs as, as possible. Okay, at least they're targeting us. That's good. Okay, who do we got here? Rhino? Yeah. Let's get up here. Let's engage this guy. Let's try and get rid of him. How do we do here? Wow, oh, I've got the arm. Critical hit, Commander. Okay, we'll should be able to wipe wipe him out this turn. Yeah. He's one Thunderbolt 20 away from being destroyed. The Chikata. Horrible shot. Okay, Rhino, let's 
just move into here. All right, what do we got here? 48, 55 with a thunderbolt, meh. Nah. Like I said, this guy's one thunderbolt away from being killed. Let's put everything else onto the cicada. It's a lot of hitting the rocks there, buddy. Yep. That is a kill. Okay, Steve, we could we could engage that javelin with three PPCs, or we could kill the cicada. I'm thinking maybe we go after the cicada. Well, it's got pretty darn chunky armor, relatively. 320, it's about the same as the javelin. So let's just move in and kill the cicada. Fire everything on him. Or not kill him. Alright, that guy got away. Hopefully. Alright, there's our turrets, man. Definitely gonna need those. As long as they hit something. Let's find out what they are here in a second. Yeah, that's good. Yeah! That laser turret's in a good spot, I think. Okay, he's going down. Listen to that creak. Okay, so what do we got here? Hardened sniper turret, bombast, two light AC5s, and a light rifle. Ah, uh, MML turret, not really in the right place with a machine gun array. Large two mediums and two machine guns. And large two mediums and two machine guns, okay. So I think these two are in a good position to protect this side. This one's in an okay position for here. This might get some shots off, but... Alright, not too bad. Alright, Rocky. What do we want to do here? Don't think we want to be too far forward, but I think we want to take an... Well... That guy's going on turn one. It's not like he's actually going to be doing anything. No point in rushing to kill him. But this bushwhacker... Uh, where does he got his... Case machine gun ammo. You are larger than the center light engine so we really have to just blow this guy up let's just target him and fire ah. well we had to get it started We've got lots of evasion so it's not like they're gonna hit us so don't know where that guy's going oh melee 33 eh okay All right, Hellcat. All right, I don't want to move my guys too far out this way. We're going to need to come back in a minute because there's going to be reinforcements most likely. Um, what's this guy got left here in the CT? 48, so we're going to multi-target. Fire against him and him. B is going to get the mediums and A will take the PPCs. Ah, one hit, not bad. Maybe we kill this guy on the ground. Nope. I just said don't move too far this way. But we got to get that guy, so... 70%. Nice. Alright, we're just going to move up. Let's try and make quick work of this bushwhacker if we can. Going to confirm the warlord. And uh, we're going to target the bushwhacker and fire everything. Ah, only two PPC hits. What's up, boss? Rhino. Let's get our multi-target going. And B will take... Um, 
All the machine guns. And a medium laser. Alright, fire the rest. Confirmed. Hit him. Yes! Whole right side gone. Nope, not enough to kill him, though. Reporting critical hit. This gyro's almost gone, though. Alright, buddy, get out here and give us some help. Torian's already proven themselves unreliable, untrustworthy. Not telling us the whole truth, but we would never have taken the mission if we knew the whole truth, so kind of understand why they lied. Nice. As long as we get paid. I'm not going to be getting much salvage out of this because I got a feeling the uh, Federated Sons will be bringing more units in right away. Yeah, here they come. One drop ship. That it? Nope, more guys down here. A quick draw, lovely. Okay, at least you're shooting me. Don't shoot the buildings. Now we got quick draw parts. Pretty sure we got quick draw parts. Alright, Steve. Um, I think you need to be the guy that kills the uh, the whacker here. What's he got left in the center here? Don't know if you'll kill him. But we'll definitely inflict a lot of damage. We can't have this guy over here, so let's just fire straight on him. Okay, he's going down. Okay, he's almost out of the battle. Javelin. We're going to sick um, Rocky and the Rave back after that Javelin. Waiting for orders. Roger. See if we can get this guy. Hopefully a quick kill. Fire everything. Locking in all weapons. Oh, right, it's the not XL version. Oh, okay. We need to engage these guys. And these guys. What do we got here? Two vehicles. Centurion. Hunchback. Okay, they're having a good time in, in, in engaging us, which is probably good. Okay, these guys actually have pretty good armor. I'm kind of shocked overall. That's good. What do we got? Quick draw. Two vehicles. 45, 50, 25. Hunchback. A Brutus. That's not good. Bulldog. That's not good. Well, he's not too bad. Okay, so... Hellcat. I'm receiving you. Hmm. Quick draw is already gone. God. Uh, what do we do here? Should be able to remove the bushwhacker. Let's get on this quick draw. Wow. Um... Don't think we're going to get a much better chance than this with a Warlord. So let's fire everything. Nicely done. That hit something good. My big fear was that um, if we done it, if I was hoping I was going to do a um, a uh, offensive push, try for a uh, center torso shot. But if we had missed with anything, I would rather hit him with everything, weaken him up. Maximum hover transport. That guy's steppable, I think. Stop shooting my buildings. Well, there's only Torians in there. I don't care. 
But that being said, yeah, they're going to destroy these turrets before they really get a chance to do anything. Do this. And how much armor does this guy have? Ooh, okay. Um and this guy? Even less. Okay, so we're gonna multi-target. Gonna shoot this guy. And this guy. Thunderbolt going to B. And let's put everything else on A. Hopefully we finish that guy up. Okay, he's gone. Let's hope we hit here. Nicely done. Okay. That problem solved. This flank is falling. We're not really in a position to get back over there fast. I think Steve's going to have to get over there himself. Eh. Okay, as long as they're shooting on the vehicles, we still have a, all our turrets still have a chance to go. Okay. All right, not bad. Good start. Shooting at the wrong guy though, but okay. And nobody else can shoot, of course. Lovely. we get over here 51 percent 18 23 how much armor does this guy have a lot um, yeah let's get started on them not bad chances to hit we'll fire all three And we'll shoot the guys that are over on that hill over there. You guys didn't see them, but they were there. Ready for order. Yep, they were there, alright. Okay, that guy's gone. This side's clear. Target neutralized. Okay. Quick draw is the next target on this side. We gotta take him down. Ah, crap. A friendly structure has been destroyed. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Oh. Okay. Oh, we got targets, alright. Got multi targets. This guy, and this guy. Thunderbolt going to B, everything else to A. I copy. Come on. Drop this guy. Oh, you missed with it with an 87% chance. What? No joy. Stop doing that. We put that big gun in there for a reason. Where are you going? As long as you're not shooting on the uh, buildings, we're good with that. Getting paid enough to take care of this damage, I'm not worried. Still have no idea what this 45 tonner is down here. Everything into this guy, please. My god, the misses with the PPCs is getting ridiculous. Shoot. Two buildings down. Did 
They just got too much firepower. Well, if the Torians all die in there, not my problem. Where are you going? Yeah, thanks for coming out, buddy. Thanks for helping with your side. Blackjack old. Wow. <sighs> and we're going dark on that side now. Man, you gotta do more than that. Turrets, where are you? Yep, thanks for helping out. Well, at least you hit with something. Not much we can really do here, guys. Dump everything into this guy. Wow. Standing by. I'm there. Confirmed. Okay, at least we got that guy. Five turns left, man. We only got we got to defend one building. We gotta knock it down, there's not a damn thing we can do about it. Okay, maybe we killed them? Yep, nice. We might just recover here. Um. Dump everything on this guy. Damn. Not enough. Yeah, there it goes. Breach of contract. Where are you going? Besides blocking my way. Okay. Well, at least they're shooting the turrets. Okay, shooting the vehicles. Nice. Keep shooting that guy. Keep him busy. Oh, you're penetrating him now. Nice. Okay. Waiting for orders. Copy that. Uh, we can't multi-target, of course. But we can shoot up the Centurion.
Speaking of Warlord. Ah. It's a tough choice. We could just try to punch through the side of this guy. I think we should multi-target though. B will take the medium laser and put everything else on A. Okay. I think as long as we keep these guys engaged, they might not shoot at the building. Yeah, maybe I'm a Chinese jet pilot. Uh, okay, can we target both? could or let's do this and let's drop we won't be able to kill it with a Thunderbolt 20 but we can hit now nah, we can't even hit that game with 27% 48 on this guy 55 let's drop it on this guy Nice. I don't know where he's going. Commander? Um, we need to target both people here. Aye. Okay, so we're going to multi target. And B will get the mediums. And PPC is an ER to large or ER to A. Nice. Do we get him? Okay, good damage though. Good damage. Reporting critical hit. Come on, man, get up here and direct fire these guys. Why are you hiding back there? Why you hide? Yeah, come on, shoot me. Tag me, you bastard. I'm shocked that uh, Hunchback is still standing, though. There you go, get up here, shoot somebody. Hope these turrets kill this uh, hunchback. It would be sweet justice if they did. Come on, he's completely unstable. Okay, there's a knockdown. He should have two pilot wounds now. Yeah. Oh, total fail as the turret, man. What are you doing? Still got his big side here open. Okay. Okay. Seventy percent with the PPCs. Eighty five. Let's get into here. Let's drop everything on this guy. Get up here. Aye, aye. Don't have multi target. These guys both go on eight. Shoot the Brutus. Aye, aye.
Okay, Rhino. Gonna multi target here. B is gonna get the Thunderbolt, fire everything else to A. Come on, drop it right on him. Here it comes. Yes! Satisfying. So much better than the AC-20. Did I say that out loud? Now it's going to get blown up. Watch. Going for the back shot, eh? Don't blame you. I would too. Oh! Wow. That's a weird uh, target, but sure. Sure, we'll take that. I'm receiving you. Let's get up to here. Coordinates received. And hooray, guess what's back, guys? Take this. Boom. Looks like I only the new target. Yep, you will. Oh, now they move forward. Thanks, guys. Thanks for coming out. So we may actually pull ourselves out of this one. Now that I've said that, someone's going to target the goddamn building. Look at their pink. Nice. That's actually a really nice shade. I like that. It's like a pinky purple color. With like metal and a dark green bluey color here. Pretty cool. Okay. Come on. Still targeting the right person. I don't like having to pay for all the repairs, but I won't have anything to pay out unless we actually finish this mission, so. Headshot? Headshot? No? What's up, boss? Alright, so... Are we green? We're green. Green for go. Green for go. Do we do a uh, offensive push? I think we just shoot them. Let's make them panicked. Let's get rid of this guy. Hopefully. There we go. They're down to two now. I think we may have pulled this one off, guys. I copy. think we need to kill this guy. Yep, let's just do it. Everything on this guy. I copy. Oh, come on. I guess Steve's got to do it. And hey, guess what? I can't really move anywhere. Oh, yes, I can. Never mind. Take it back. Oh. That's uh, multi target. And. Thirty seven, eh? One PPC to B, everything else to A. Oh, really? Damn you. No Gonna have like one turn left to finish these guys up. Should be able to do it, I think. Come on, knock him down. Somebody's gotta knock him down. Come on, guys. Or make him panic and jump out. Okay, shot the turret. Shoot him in the back. Or kill that guy, one of the two. Gotta kill him though. <sighs> I 
Okay, as long as it's the turret, I don't care. Whew. That building's got 17 left. What's up, boss? Roger that. Let's get rid of this guy. Roger. Yeah. Don't turn your back to one of those guys, guys. Never put your back to a thunderbolt. Yes, Commander. Commander. All right, Rock, finish this guy up, please. It's all yours, girl. That should do it. There it is, folks. All right, we're going to gather up our salvage and get paid. See you guys back on the ship. All right, so we were make, able to make it out of the valley there. They gave us a huge bonus of payment, 30%, which is pretty big. Almost a million sea bills we raked in. And we did pretty well. We barely got any damage. The Jager mech took a bunch, but I put him in harm's way on purpose. So he didn't get any kills this match. Not that I care, but still, the victor racks up four in a vehicle. Once again, that Thunderbolt proving that it's it's definitely worthwhile having in there. Alright, Bushwhacker parts. What else do we got here? Cicada parts, meh. Quick draw parts. We've got four? I thought we had a lot more than this. Four 5A parts. Um, what else is down here? Is there anything of any value? I don't think so, though. Most of this was pretty stock. Endo steel. I think we've got a bunch of endo steel still. Yeah, we got two left over. Fusion core. I don't think we really need it. I think we're going to go for mech parts this time. TTS ballistic. Mm -hmm. We can always get those, I think. So let's go for a quick draw part. Where are we here? Quick draw part. And... Let's grab another bushwhacker part. We might be able to pick up a bushwhacker. Let's confirm this. All right, two bushwhacker parts, cicada part, locust part, LRM5, medium rifle, and junk. That mech you wanted, oh, well, hello there. We got a bushwhacker, guys. Um, yeah, man. That's cool. 33,000. That's a lot less than I thought it was going to be, which is good. So it looks like we don't need to bring the Wolverine forward or Centurion forward. We can use the Bushwhacker now. Let's have a look at this. Alright, Bushwhacker. What do we got? Oh, looks like we get to save a lot of stuff off this. So actually not bad. The engine, double heatsink kit, endo steel, extra cooling. Let's pull this out gonna leave all this stuff in though yeah man that's excellent 348,000 in 10 days to repair let's confirm this yeah man that was totally worth it gorilla prototype eh all right now I don't know why why do I keep thinking we have quick draw parts We've got five quick draw parts here. I keep thinking, well, I don't know why we keep thinking we have quick draw parts. What is going on with me today? We've got, I don't know. We don't have quick draw parts. Oh, we got three Axeman parts though. 65 ton Axeman. Much better than Hatchman, I'm assuming. Yeah, so that's another thing we should be looking out for. Picking up Axemans. Um, Fists of Dorne mentioned we should pick, probably pick up a Hatchman or a uh, uh, Bushwhacker. Or not a Bushwhacker, there's another one. I can't remember what it's called. No Dachi, I think it's called. Uh, is our melee mech instead of the Wolverine. But we've got one Hatchman part now. Um... Do we have any more? I thought we faced more than one hatchetman in the past little while. Nope, I guess not. 
All right, well, we've got one hatchetman part, and we've got three axeman parts. be nice if we can get an axeman. That'd be a 65-ton uh, melee mech with a nice big engine in it. You kidding me? That'd be awesome. All right, well, can't do anything about this right now. So here's what we're going to do. Um, the next episode, we're going to do a refit episode because we have a couple of new mechs that we need to work on. Um, we've got the Bushwhacker that we just picked, picked up, and we've got the Mjolnir that we want to outfit as well. Um, so we're going to outfit those two mechs, and then we'll have two lances of guys right now. And then we'll have a look at our pilots and see if our second lance is capable of actually pulling off some half-decent missions. And then what we're going to do um, the following episode is we're going to quickly jump. Uh, let's go to the star map real quick, like as I mentioned before. We're going to quickly jump over to um, Brockway, and we're going to take this um, if we can if we can actually take it. Um, this flashpoint to see if we can actually get it done. It expires in 91 days, so we're going to attempt to do this. Um, I don't know. It says it's a short mission, Eng engagement like short. I don't know what that means. Whether it's once or one or two, one missions or two missions or what it is, but we'll have enough pilots to do that. We can split them in half um, to have two relatively good strength lances. Uh, but I want to make sure we have our guys laid out before we do that. So we're really close by. We're only 11 days away. So we'll jump there really quick, and then right after that, we're going to try and do a big jump over to here somewhere, uh, and then start heading. Well, not really north, but started heading upwards on the map here to head towards clan space. And we'll try to do big jumps too, like like two-day jumps, so we're not just going from one planet at a time. We'll do like, you know, a double jump, and then another double jump up over here somewhere, just so we can get there a little quicker. Um, also, depending on how much cash we have too, right? So we'll try and get there a little quicker to get into some, some combats, because I think our lances are in pretty good shape right now. Um, right after we tweak them up in here, we can test them out um, on Brockway, and then um, as we head up, we'll be able to test them out and refit them slightly, and hopefully we pick up a few new, few new mechs. So I think we're going to need a melee mech for sure. Uh, running Cold Forge, I found against the clans, it's always nice to have that melee mech because um, there's just definitely those times where you absolutely have to use it. Um, unfortunately, I don't like um, brawl bots. I don't like having to use melee mechs. It's kind of fun, but I think it's completely unrealistic as well. Um, but yeah, that's just my two cents. Um, so yeah, we're going to end the episode here. If you like it, drop a like. If you got any suggestions for mech layouts, uh, please drop it in the comments below. I don't necessarily always get to them right away. It might be a few episodes because I always re record a few days ahead of time. Just so I have a chance to edit them and get them posted and everything. Um, so don't necessarily expect... Um, uh, response right away in game i will respond to your comments down below so you may have to wait a couple of episodes before um things work its way into the game but um yeah so we're gonna end the episode there and uh until next time we'll see everybody later